question outside. You thought about an in, uh, interface for information input from the community. If, if I think about the knowledge in this room, it's immense. It must be filtered anywhere and uh, must be put together in the, in the huge database, must be come into your, your project in anywhere. It's, it's, it's not necessarily our project, but um, and, and uh, uh, so I, I it should be the, the, the not in the middle, G giving it to yes, the public from sometimes. But if you ha ha have to give something outside, you have uh, to look for a, a good way to get something inside, and there's much more information on, on this side. Yes. But it's, it's, it's not accessible for everyone. So the, uh, the, the, the common researcher usually uh, has not the time to, to research uh, your structures. <laughs> he, he, he's researching what, what he's used to research, and these are libraries. But the libraries are not connected to the knowledge and to the data you have. And you, you so just make this. You, you just you have to just make that connection, and and then I think um, 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 one is one is um, um, able to to to, um, to to grant for for new money to advance this system, and and so I think this this is something which um, everyone um, could participate. Um, and um, which might help everyone. You, you, you're surely aware that what, what happened to Home of the Underdogs um, um, two years ago, um, um, that um, the, the provider, um, the, um, the woman who, who maintained and set, set, set up uh, Home of the Underdogs, dogs, so he, he, he went bankrupt and, and all of a sudden um, the, all the data was gone. And, and this is something, of course, which must be prevented. She had backups, and, 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 and so now home of the underdogs are more than one um, revival project of home of the underdogs, which is a problem because um, it, she, she gave it to the community, and, and um, now um, the community wasn't um, um, uh, was not able to, 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 to decide to do it in one way, so at least two Home of the Underdogs projects are developing now separately from each other, which is of course a loss because now I have to research two databases to get the whole thing, and this is something we should prevent in the future. And so um, my suggestion is coming together and, 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 and everyone puts his knowledge and his, um, his um, um, things he can bring in, in, in into such a project and that's a huge load of, of things you can donate to such a project um, put in and then um, 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 joining forces <laughs> doing projects together so that's, that's, my, uh, that's my suggestion I have in terms of the archival of software, I don't think you'll get that. I don't think you'll succeed in convincing the different people to work together. Um, I've done a lot of this myself, of you know, dumping old, um, say, acorn disks, things like, you know, the floppy disks, the cassettes. And you find that usually the projects are one or two individuals who've dedicated their life to a particular format. And they will fight tooth and nail to argue why their format is better than the other format. We have software conservation group over here. There's a, yeah, there are Argentinian groups, there are French groups, there are German groups. And I think rather than trying to unify formats, you need to support everybody. Because it doesn't do any harm if you have five multiple copies of the same data in slightly different formats. Do you see what I mean? But that's just from my experience of working with the groups in the last few you know, in the last ten years or so. <coughs> that they don't, they will all diss the other format, you know. Which, 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 which yeah. kind of format? Yeah. You mean yeah. image, image format? Yeah, the, image, the software image, you have IPF, you have F, that's yeah, yeah. The IPF, um, FDR, and goodness knows, past leaders, yeah. all sorts. And yeah, you yeah get somehow, so, so in, in the yeah. key project, uh, one, one of our task is to develop a, a transfer tool framework which somehow should uh, make use uh, from existing uh, transfer tools like this to FDE or the software's CAPS uh, system, yes. yeah, yeah, the CAPS okay. system. Um, and somehow it's just a framework and uh, depending on the, the kind of, of, of uh, data and data carrier which uh, should be uh, transferred um, then the um, respective transfer tool is somehow um, um, configured 
uh, and it's configured somehow by the archivists. So, so he he's he uh, uh, depending on uh, on the um, archivist on on um, his policy of preservation. So for us, some things are let's say let, let's take the caps. Thing. So uh, one can argue, for me it's not that important that the copyright protection is preserved as well, so I can live with correct versions. So the policy of the CAPS project, which is quite near to our policy as well, is that they say no, then it's um, a corrupted uh, code, it's not the original code anymore, so our policy is to develop transfer tools which are able to transfer the copyright protection mechanism as well. Yeah. And um, of course, you need then that images, and also you need these uh, emulators who are able to run this format. And um, this is depending on the policy. And somehow, every archive has to set up its own policy. And um, so it's 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 not. We are not. <coughs> Our role is not somehow to, to say that's the right one or that's the wrong one. So somehow we, of course, consider what is our policy. And then, but with projects like KEEP, we want to develop frameworks and systems which are flexible enough to offer every archive the option to implement its own policy and to use the framework um, um, and doing their there are things which are important for them. And of course, it's, it's an important issue you are just raising. And, and um, I don't expect that we all can agree to one policy. But um, what, what we can do is make a suggestion. And then um, um, f um, um, coming together with interested people. And then there's a second round of, of negotiations and discussions. And it might be that the suggestions change afterwards. And may, it might also be that some of the interested people disappear because they, that's not our system again. But I think, and I'm, I'm, I'm very confident that uh, uh, with these two steps you will find um, a significant uh, 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 group of people um, which uh, are big enough and, and, and skilled enough to, 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 to implement such an agreement and, and making an example. And then maybe others jump on that train or others set up another thing. That might be. But what in the, in the, in the moment is important is that these communities which used to, to work all for its own and it's, it's a retro gamer community and it's an institutional community and it's a little bit also the emulation community and it's not you, you, you can't talk about an emulation community because every emulator project is very decent as you very very dedicated as you know and, and, and some of them don't like each other and, and of course you know that but um, I'm, I'm not that um, um, I'm, I'm confident I'm just confident that it's the right time to, 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 to make that offer to invite people to join forces and then starting that discussion process and trying to get uh, a grants for project Thank you. Yes. Yeah, I have uh, one last question for Paul yes, uh, yeah. it may be an obvious question really but you know for all the time you went that we shouldn't hold the game to work and what is your favourite beer? <laughs> 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 I guess not the German one. Right? <laughs> 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 That's just <laughs> 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 Yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah, right then. Okay then, well, uh, thank you very much, uh, Andreas and Tom. Now I'm sure that well, Bob and Andreas will be sticking around uh, at least for a little, little while. So I've eaten his pie. I'm sure if anybody wants to buy uh, Andreas or Bob uh, a pint, um, then you might be able to work out what, uh, what Bob's favourite beer is and maybe what Andreas' favourite beer is as well. So, uh, and then of course we've got uh, Bob's uh, artwork to look at here and outside if you, if you wanted to. So uh, thank you very much again, uh, gents.